So we're talking about the Secure Act 2.0, and in the comment, we will have the link where it has all the details about all the different things that are part of the Secure Act 2.0. But we wanted to talk about specifically RMDs, required minimum distributions. Those of you um, that are retired, that are of the age, are already well aware of what RMDs are. But for those of you who maybe are years off before retirement, years off before you're going to take those, we'll just do a quick refresher. Uh, required minimum distributions, RMDs, are basically when you reach a certain age, your 401k, IRAs, whatever you rolled it over to, um, have never been taxed. So the required minimum distribution basically just states that there's a certain amount at a certain age that you have to start taking out. And of course, that amount grows by some equation each year. Um, in the SECURE Act 2.0, uh, for quite some number of years, the rule has been when you turn 70 and a half, you have to start taking that RMD or that required minimum distribution. Um, recently, in 2019, they changed that to 72. So that at age 72, instead of 70 and a half, you needed to start taking those required minimum distributions. And then with the SECURE Act 2.0 that passed recently, uh, they are raising that to 73 uh, this year, 2023. And then in 2033, they are raising that to age 75. So a lot of different numbers, a lot going on. The important thing to remember is if you haven't already take, taken RMDs at 73 years old is going to be the new number. Later, that number is going to graduate to taking RMDs at age 75.